Advent of Season 4, it's time for our experts, Shia and Shashank, to don the hat of styling and perfectionism once again for the confident, fashion-forward brides and grooms who dream of stealing the show on their wedding day. An Indian wedding is no less than a regal occasion, and the protagonists on the center stage appear no less than a king and queen with their precious attire to match the extravagant ambience and mood. So it is our experts' prime concern to match up to their expectation or even to surprise them with their exclusive collection to enhance their bridal dress up and look more beautiful. On today's show, we are to meet Poonam and Nikhil, who have come to select Nikhil's attire for their wedding day, and Tanner, who is here to select her wedding lehenga. Let's get to know more about them. So my name is Poonam Patel. I'm from East Hanover, New Jersey. Today, I brought with me my mom, Neelam, my younger sister, Sapna, and Nikhil, my fiance. My name is Nikhil Jane. I grew up in Freehold, New Jersey. My name is Nila. I'm a housewife. My name is Sapna. I'm Putnam's youngest sister. I'm getting married at the Rockley um, in northern New Jersey in spring. We met in our atrium of our medical school building and then you know, we hit it off from there. We went to Sedona, Arizona and with the help of her sisters and her younger brother, helped plan a surprise proposal on a hike. Uh, we went on something called Devil's Bridge, which is about 150 feet high in the air. And, uh, you know, I bent the knee there. The moment I knew Nikhil was the one for me was a couple years into medical school. Um, it's a very rough time that we both went through together and after we both went through it, and we are now, you know, doing our dream profession, is when I knew that we could go through anything together. Hi guys, how's everyone doing today? Doing good. And how are you? Good. She told me you guys will be coming in for your bridal wear appointment today. Yeah, that's true. Do you have any ideas as to what you're looking for? Just wedding outfit, something uh, classic. Poonam, do you have any preferences for... We'll be doing gold for him. My dress is all red and just whatever he likes, I guess. All right, I'll pick out a couple of outfits and bring him out for you. Sounds good. Yep. My name is Tanner Okolinski. I am originally from Pittsburgh, uh, but I live in New York City right now. Today I brought my college roommate, Britta. She's going to be one of my bridesmaids. My name is Britta Conley. I'm uh, from Cleveland, Ohio. I am here to select my wedding linga and uh, accompanying jewelry. I met Mo. Uh, we used to work at the same company and we kind of knew each other for like a year and only really hung out a few times and then somebody bought out our company and he felt okay to ask me out on a date after that and the rest is history. I knew Mo was the one probably pretty early on when he told me he had an interview across the country and was maybe gonna move and that was about a month into us dating and I just had this reaction that was like <gasps> Oh my god, if I'm never gonna see this guy ever again. And at that point I just I knew this was this was a big deal of relationship. Hey ladies, welcome to Najana. My name is Shia. Hi Shia, I'm Tanner. Hi Tanner. Hi, I'm Britta. Hi Britta. Anjali texted me last night saying that Tanner's coming in to find her wedding linga. Yeah, she was the one that led me here, so I, I trust I'm in good hands. Yes, we <laughs> dressed her almost five years ago, I would say, for her wedding and her reception outfit. She's great. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. So tell me a little bit more. What are you looking for? What is the vision for your wedding? So, I mean, we're blending cultures. Um, we're going to have a Hindu ceremony and then I will change into my American uh, wedding dress for the reception. <laughs> I think my mother-in-law would really like me to do something traditional. I know Bengali culture, they really want red and you know, super traditionally, saris. Um, Anjali specifically went with a lenga, and so I think I'm at least allowed to do a lenga. Um, I would be curious to see some other colors other than red. Red is really not my favorite, but um, I will also try on some red just to please my mother-in-law and to see how it, how it looks. But yeah, I think I'm kind of interested in some golds too. Um, Ah, but I'm glad you have the go-ahead to try lengas on. Mm -hmm. So I can definitely pull out some gold ones, some red ones, and we can take it from there. Did you have anything in mind for Tanner? 
No, I mean, I think Tanner will look beautiful no matter what she wears, so. Um, cheerleader over here. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, I mean, whatever she, you know, feels the best in. I think. Great. So I'm going to head in the back. I'm going to pull out a few options, and I'll be right back. So, Nikhil, I picked this one because I felt like this is a shade that would complement uh, Poonam's red really well. Um, I know it's a little on the lighter side, but I, I wanted to show something heavy for Auntie and then something light for you. So, just want to get your feedback on this one. It's simple. I wish it had a little bit more color, but uh, I don't mind it. Yeah? What do you guys feel about this one? I agree. I think the base color would complement Poonam's dress really well, the shade of red, but I'm not sure about how much work it is because we're used to a lot more style and more sparkle, but I think he should definitely try this one on. Okay. What about you, Poonam? It looks like something I think I would dress my brother in and not my groom. Okay. Andy? Yeah, I don't like everything. It's a little bit more work. Um, will Shia be coming? No, so unfortunately, Shia won't be able to make it this appointment um, just because I handle all the men's appointments. Got it. Uh, so yeah, but don't worry, you're in good hands. All right. Just because I feel like she has a feel of what we've been looking for for the past couple months with all the outfits that we've chosen with her. You know, makes makes sense. Uh, she showed me your outfit last night, so I kind of have an idea of uh, like what you're going for. It might just take a little little bit to fine tune what you like, uh, but I think we can get there. All right. So Nikhil, this is one of her heavier Shervanis. Um, the red on this would match Poonam's red really well. How do you feel about this? I really like it. I think I'd be excited to try this one on. I think it uh, might be a, a big boost from the uh, earlier one that I tried on. Okay, Poonam? I just want to say, I'm a little concerned about the red because I'm not sure how well it'll match because we're not really like looking at Poonam's at the same time. That might be something Chia would be able to help with because she helped us pick out Poonam's outfit. Oh, um, okay. I like the overall design. I like that it's a little flashier than the last one. Um, but Sapna has a valid point. I, I'm not sure if it'll match. I thought I was getting closer to your taste. Am I still really off? Do we still want him to try this or? It's up to Nikhil if he wants to try it. I, I, I like it. Okay. Yeah, so we want to try this on? Yeah, I'd love to try it on. Let's try uh, your first one first and then, then we'll try this one. Okay. So I pulled out a few options, some gold lenga, some red lengas, and Anshul will bring out the first option. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow. That's very pretty. It's beautiful. Yeah, I mean, maybe it's not quite as sparkly as I would have thought the gold would be. I thought it would be just like shining right at me, but I mean, it's, it's really pretty. I think the detailing is really nice. I wonder how it's gonna look on my coloring. I'm feeling yeah, like now right that on. I see gold in person, I'm curious. But it, but it's still really pretty. I'd still like to try it on. Yeah. So the reason I picked this, it's all silk. Um, and in my head, if um, I paired this with a red bridal dupatta or a Banarsi dupatta mm -hmm. with some jewelry with red beads, I think it can really give you a classic look. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, you definitely need to try it on and see how it looks on you. Okay. So we'll keep this in the try-on pile and look at the next one. Yeah. So this is a beautiful oh. silk langa. It's traditional, it's classic. To me, it's the the real Indian Bengali bride. Yeah, this is, this is much better than a lot of the things that I had seen online that just looked like... I like that the red is... It reminds me of my, my favorite MAC lipstick color, actually, <laughs> so... <laughs> So you want to give this one a shot? We'll try this one? Yes. Okay. Great. So let Anshul bring out the gold one, and then we'll try the gold one first. Okay. Sounds good. Hello. I like the pop of red, but I don't like that the colors aren't matching at all. The pants don't match the top. It's just not working for me in terms of shades of colors. On to you. I like the pattern, but I feel like it's a little bit more neat sign on the booties. Okay. Well, our family is very used to bling and shine, and I don't really see that with this outfit. I think that's something Shia really knows about us, that we like a lot of work in our outfits. But it's, it's definitely, it's better than I was expecting. Okay. I think the other thing that Shia also really knows well is the color matching. I'm very big on matching the reds perfectly and the, the golds perfectly. And, and the dupatta doesn't match for you? It looks more like just off tones of gold and silver. I didn't give him something like really simple, but I wanted him to try something medium and then something heavy. Uh, so I guess this is a no. Uh, let's have you try the next one. I thought he looked very good in it. Um, I can completely understand their viewpoint that it, it might be too simple, but that was kind of the reason why I was showing this one. Um, I, however, completely disagree on the red. 
because I've literally taken the scarf, matched it to the lenga, and then brought it out. How do you feel? <laughs> it is very pretty, though. In, in fact, I don't think it actually washes me out as much as I thought it did. I mean, but... I mean, it's beautiful and you look beautiful. Um, yeah, maybe with a, a bold lip is all you would need. Yeah, <laughs> it, it probably do need more exaggerated makeup or, or something. Yeah. Overall, I mean, I'm really satisfied with how this one looks like. How do you feel with showing the cleavage? Because I know if your mother-in-law is traditional, I don't think she'll appreciate that, especially when you're doing the ceremony at the mandap and you have to bend over and reach the fire. Hmm. I guess it could be. I hadn't really thought of that before. I mean, I'm not really normally wearing these low-cut shirts. Britta might, Britta might object. Back in our college days, I probably had a few more low-cut items. Not so much anymore, but uh, it doesn't offend me. But if you're, if you're worried that it might offend my mother-in-law, I'll take your word for it and, you know. Yeah, I think or so. We can pull it up a bit or we something. We can pull it up a little bit for sure during alterations. But I pulled um, a beautiful necklace set that has a Rani heart. It's a longer piece of jewelry and a choker. Okay. So let's try that on. Let's see if that helps cover it up a little bit. Okay. Yeah. So let Anshul bring out the set and see if you like that. Sounds good. So Tanner, I picked a contrasting maroon polky necklace. It has beautiful pearls in it. I really think it'll bring this pop to the outfit and your overall look. Yeah, I'll okay. give it a try. And Anshul's also going to give you a second dupatta, which is also the maroon color. Okay. Yeah. Wow, so pretty. I feel like a queen. <laughs> This, this is like definitely crazy. gives me that pop that I was looking for. Um, I feel very heavy though. Um, does this look like too much? No? It's not too much. I'm like the queen of Versailles. <laughs> I do like it. It's just, you know, something to get used to. Definitely keep this in mind. And now let's move on to the red one and see how she looks in the red. So I'm trying my best to navigate between the two dilemmas that we have and one idea that I had with the gold lenga was to add some red to it to add some of the the traditional old school red to it and then the jewelry and the dupatta really made it pop which I loved what do you think of this the are you happier with the, the pants top. yes mm -hmm. okay they're the same color at least <laughs> yeah think? I like it are you okay with the heaviness of it yeah because this one's like front and back. It's pretty loaded. I think I can manage. Can we see the back? <laughs> wow, okay. it looks nice. Definitely better in terms of work, but I'm still, I'm concerned about whether the red is going to match Poonam's dress. I have matched the reds. It's the same exact red that's on her outfit. Are you sure? The seam's a little brighter. Yeah. Yeah, but I've, I've sort of like matched it to the T and it's the same exact thing. Did you ask Shia what the color number was and match those up? No. Um, you know what, let me do this. Let me see if she's done with her appointment, um, and I'll try to see if I can get her in. We would really appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, okay. Do you actually like it? Yeah, I like it. Why? You don't? Which I one? like it. It's a good amount of work. I feel like it's enough for us, but also not too much for you. feel? Not quite as bad as I thought. Um, in fact, it's it's kind of nice. Yeah. Um, I really like that the top is different, but I, I love this like border on the skirt. That's like my favorite part. What do you think? Better than gold? Yeah. Yeah? I mean, what do you think? I really had my heart set on gold, kind of, but... Uh, and I do think this is something your mother-in-law will love. I think so, too. I know you mentioned something about your lipstick. Was that color pretty much that's the color of this outfit? Yeah, I mean, Max Ruby Woo, right? I mean, that's that's the, the go-to for most people. And I feel like this is like the color that matches and probably the color that I would wear. So let's try on. I picked out another jewelry set with this one, which is just gold. I did one more red. So let Ancho help you put that on and then we'll see. All right. Yeah. How 
do you feel? I do like it. It's is the red growing on you? I think so. I think so. What do you What do you think? It looks great. Because we definitely came in here like gold. I think you're getting the gold in this red dress. Oh yeah. <laughs> She totally is. She totally is. Yeah. I know Mo's mom will probably really prefer the red, and since it's coming around, I'm coming around anyways to it, I guess I think we'll go with the red. But Tanner, I mean, would you like to come back with her and look at more options? I feel pretty confident in this, and I don't really want any other opinions at this point. I think okay. I'm just like, I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> but do you think making yeah. the decision so quickly is is smart? I feel like this is amazing. I just feel like the more you see things, the more it clouds your judgment and feel like I know what I want when I see it, so. Great. I guess the biggest question I'm going to ask you, Tanner, are you ready to be a Nazrana bride? I'm ready to be a Nazrana bride. <laughs> well, that was super quick and super easy for me, to be honest. <laughs> We have a little gift for you. Ancho's going to bring it out. Here you go. And don't be surprised, it is red. <laughs> oh, of course. <laughs> oh, so cute. <laughs> well, I'm really happy though. I think you look beautiful and I'm 100% sure your mother-in-law will love it. All right, well, thank you so much for your help. It's such a pleasure. I think Tanner was ready to make the purchase and nobody really pushed her to try other outfits on, which really worked for me because it was a really short appointment. And my goal was to make sure that she finds an appropriate Lenga, which she did. Shwangi, I really need you in this appointment. I am showing them everything that matches their outfit for, for Puna. Which appointment? For Puna. You showed me Puna's Lenga last night, right? Mm -hmm. I'm matching his dupatta to the T. It's the same exact shade of red that's on her outfit. But they won't believe me. They're like, it doesn't go, it doesn't match. I'm like, it doesn't matter what I show them. It's like, from the time they've come in, they want Shia. So I don't know what you're doing. Is your appointment done? No, my appointment will start in a few. So before you start the other one, just jump in and, and say hi to them and, and please take care of this for me. Okay, if you want, I'll yeah, be there. So just, just come. I'm gonna tell them you'll come in 30 seconds, but just come now. Are you so annoyed? I'm not annoyed, it's just, I've matched it to the T, dude. Like, there's, it doesn't get better in terms of matching than what I did. You're so annoyed because they like me more. Yeah, sure, that's exactly <laughs> what so it is. They like me more. Alright, just come. I'll be right there. So, is she coming? So, she's just finishing up her appointment. She should be here any minute. Uh, but guys, I'm telling you, she's gonna tell you the same thing. This is the same exact shade of red from your outfit. <laughs> Nikhil, you look really good. Thanks so much. This is beautiful. Um, is this what you guys shortlisted? Yes, we really like this outfit. We're just concerned that the colors might not match perfectly. I actually think the color is pretty good, but why don't we do this just to be sure? Um, I have your wedding langa in alterations. Why don't we quickly put that on? What do you think? Yeah, I think that would be ideal. I mean, I this way you could see the color. Yeah, so Poonam, why don't you come with me and then we'll try on your wedding lingo. All right. Poonam looks absolutely beautiful. Wait till you see her. Oh my God. Wow. Oh, you gorgeous. like it? <laughs> see all of it? Wow. Yeah, it looks really good together. Very nice. So actually the red is perfect. The red is really good. Good job. <laughs> Seeing them together, I agree. Now, I agree. They're, they're almost they probably the exact same color. <laughs> Nikhil, how do you feel? Let's get married right now. <laughs> you want to ask him? No, you should ask him. He's no, you your ask crew. Him. You how ask about you him. both ask? <laughs> <laughs> so, Nikhil, are you, are you ready, ready to be, to be an Andromeda crew? I am. Yay. All right, so we have a small gift for you. Here you go, man. Take a look. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> nice. I understand it happened. Once you're comfortable with someone, uh, you prefer to get their opinion uh, before you can make a final decision, and that's that's essentially what happened. I, I am by no means annoyed at them, uh, but I was I was hoping uh, they would they would come around and listen to me instead of me having to bring Shia on board. We wish Poonam and Nikhil and Tanner and Munishi an amazing journey ahead and a fantabulous dream wedding. Do join us again on our journey as we move ahead with season four.
If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Nizrana Diaries.